To write the name for Li2O, we first need to recognize that lithium here, this is a metal, and then oxygen, that's a nonmetal. So when we have a metal and a nonmetal, we have an ionic compound. And we use these rules here to write the name for Li2O. First, we're going to write the name of the metal. That'll be the positive ion as it appears on the periodic table. Li, that's lithium. Next, we'll write the name for the nonmetal. That'll be the negative ion as it appears on the periodic table. So O, that's oxygen. We'll put a lowercase o. And then we're going to take the ending and replace it with IDE. So we're going to take the YGEN and replace that with IDE. And that makes the name for Li2O lithium oxide. If you were given the name lithium oxide and asked to write the formula, you'd need to know that lithium's in group one on the periodic table. It forms ions that are one plus. Oxide from oxygen, that'll form ions that are two minus. So you can see we need two of the lithiums here. So our one plus will balance out the two minus on the oxygen. This is Dr. B with the formula and the name for Li2O, lithium oxide. Thanks for watching.